Hi folks, St. Paul Steam here with something that is decidedly not steam. It's a uh, Depke model sand loader and this one has been motorized. And uh, I had a lot of fun building this and uh, finally going to take a video of it. Let's take a little bit closer look. We've got some uh, custom, custom brushed aluminum Depke model tags. We've got three of them on it. Larger one right there. The box is uh, 25 and a quarter inches, 11 and a half, and four inches tall for the most part. A little higher on the side right here. And uh, we have a 80 RPM 12 volt motor installed in their high torque, and it is high torque. Very powerful. New chain on there. I put some rollerball bearing idlers in there and uh, help it give a longer. Uh, shelf life. It's located in place by two wood blocks that hold that axle firm. You need to lift right off of there. It's got a quick disconnect for the motor over here. We have an auger system that uh, runs the medium all the way underneath. It's in a two inch tube and they're one and three quarter inch augers, two of them. And they push the medium up right here. And, uh, through the whole process and cycling back around again. That is organic black seed. I found it to work the best so far. It's slick. It doesn't compact well. It augers well. And, uh, I tried acrylic and tried plastic resin and that compacted too bad. It pushed it through but it was really working hard to do and this is a lot slicker. Took me four tries on this shield right here to get just what I wanted to kind of enable the scoops to push against something to actually get a load. And we have an on off switch here with a quick disconnect for the, the power supply so it's transportable. And this will easily start under a load. The 12 volt, uh, it has a, a two outlet 12 volt power supply underneath the base. And it takes a second for it to power up, and off you go. This is a very fun project to build. And uh, I've run it for hours. Kind of trying to uh, you know, customize it here and there and find out what I need to tweak it here and there to make it work right. I put a screen over that auger because I found out it's high torque enough that I'm afraid little fingers it would get caught in there and do some real damage and so this works out really well I put a couple of wings on it right there help guide the material in they're detachable if I want them to be but it really keeps a lot less mess down on the table this has been running for half an hour so slowly but surely I'm getting the material to go where I want it to run it long enough and this whole thing will be covered and that's kind of alright. I like to look at that too. But I plan on displaying this at shows. It's a Depke model sand loader. Customized 12 volt powered. It's hard to get it all in one shot. And there we go, folks. Thanks for looking. As always, I appreciate it. Have a great day.